So this is important for those of you using the XML file. I realize uh, that some of the fields are not actually stored as the preferred field type. For example, if we go to date, date, and we right click on it and see the column settings, it's gonna show that this is not a date field. In fact, it's not a date field at all. Let's let's go ahead, let's go ahead and look at um, uh, in fact this is like a character field. So if we wanted to modify this to a date field so we can do 18 reports, etc., then we need to go to data modify. Now this is not gonna be the case for um your access the people that were able to import this from access but so this is originally a character field and i'm going to want to change this to a date field and it's here where i would have to define the format or the mask uh that the text eight is stored under so if you notice it is year, month, and date with double digits, no matter what date of the, uh, what date it is, right? Double digits for month and, and day and four digits for year. So that should be done appropriately. So let me get rid of the quotes actually. Y -Y -Y -M -M -D -D, and there's a hyphen in between. So applying that, it's gonna say, are you sure? And sure enough, it switched that to a date. So that's very important. Um, I also wanna make sure this is a, numeric field let me look at the column settings um i can just try to modify that and see that is uh, let's switch to the, the psgst that is a character let's switch that into a numeric field with number of decimals now this is important because you don't want to lose the number of decimals uh so let's go ahead and do two and press ok uh psd modify i am Gonna modify this field. All right. So this is still a character field, but I'm gonna make it into a numeric field of two decimals. Press yes. Um Let's make sure that it's still negative, correct. Uh, what else should be numeric? It looks like the invoice number is seen as a number, right? But that should be a text field. So I'm gonna switch that back to numeric instead and press okay. Uh, let me see if the gross amount is correctly done. Yes, it's numeric and it has two fields um so everything else looks right let me just make sure this is correct this is a character field so that's it that's all we need to do for this particular uh, setting thank you